Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Football Manager 2022 as we continue our Journeyman and Glory Hunter run with Newcastle United. And congratulations to Manchester United. They've already won the league. That's pretty early lock-in for the league. I'm impressed. Uh, kudos to them, I would say. But today we play Atletico Madrid. Let's get into it. All right, here we are. As you can see, there is one blip over the last several months. We did lose to Aston Villa after beating them 5-0 in the league earlier, like a, about a, what, a, two weeks, three weeks, three weeks, two weeks earlier. I can't talk. Um, I probably did a little too much rotation. <laughs> uh, I didn't really care, and I was trying to give the guys a rest after the, the good play against Manchester United. I should have played a couple more of the starters, but... And we actually played better than them. We, we got FM'd in this game. Even though I was doing some rotation, we still got FM'd because we, we actually dominated them overall on the the the, uh, the stats and stuff like that. We had a 3.0 XG with one goal. And they had like a 1 XG with two goals. So we got a little FM'd. It's okay. I mean, it would have been nice just to kind of hang another trophy on the wall, but we didn't really need it. It's not the one that's important. So let's get into... We're, we're going to get into today's game. This is the, this is the important game. Uh, we did went up against West Ham, beat them three to two. Again, pretty heavy rotation in this game. Uh, we actually went up three nothing in the first half, and then they came back and scored a couple goals, which was a little little nervous, a little scary. But Lenardi picking up a goal, Stevanovic picking up a goal, and Samson picking up a goal. I should also say that uh, Isak the one that picked up the goal in the game against Villa. I think he's one of our few starters that we actually played. Uh, we then went up against Manchester City. I did play more of my starters in this game because I wanted to kind of get them prepped for the Atletico Madrid game. Uh, so we got a goal from Samson, a goal from Levi, a goal from Ibanez, and a goal from Luca. Luca picking up yet another goal. We did get an injury to Livermento. Little unfortunate, but thankfully we do still have Sambo to play in that spot. In fact, he probably would have started today anyway. Today is the Atletico Madrid away leg. This is going to be the tough one again, guys. We need to get one goal and not let them score more than two. So that was the plan going into the Manchester United game. Obviously, it went really well. That's the goal, though. One goal, no more than two against us. Um, here is the team we're bringing today. We have Conde and Go. We got Lamptey on the left, Sambo on the right, Ibanez and Levi in the middle, Iglesias and Mount in the midfield, although they don't really have the best working relationship right now. We're going to bring Vieira in today. He's playing really well. He's on a 7.9 last five games, 7.9 training. He's in a really good spot. We're going to give him the edge over Sancho. We'll see. We'll see how that works. Uh, Isak and Luca obviously coming here as normal. And in, today again, O'Neill Murphy gets the nod over Gerard. Just a slight edge on the overall last five games training and stuff like that. So... We'll see how this works, and let's get into this. I'm excited. Ah, oh, man, I want this so bad. Oh, I want this so bad. We came back. I say we came back to Newcastle United. We didn't really try too hard to go to another team. We were we were very limited on the teams we were trying to go to because I was like, what other teams going to be better than Newcastle United to win the Champions League? Uh, and so there were not that many teams that were out there. However, if we win it this time, we'll go to just about any team on any, any other country. Anybody that will take us just about, well, that has a chance of winning something. Atletico Madrid, they got a draw and a loss in their last five games, so they've got a little bit of a blip as well. Um, we've obviously got that loss too. So we both have have blips over the last five games. Not not the most perfect form coming into this matchup. I think this is going to be a tough game, guys. I think this is going to be a tough game. Early corner kick. Vieira, come on, Luca, 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 Luca. Oh, man. When he starts us off with a corner kick goal, it makes the rest of the game go so much better. Come on, guys. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, Marie Louise. He's one of our guys, wasn't he, from, from before? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mount with the corner kick. Goes across. There's nobody there. Uh, Iglesias isn't going to be able to chase this one down, though. Turns around. Going to be able to get into sight anybody. He's going to over to Levi. Levi over to Sambo. Sambo, don't get a takeaway from you, buddy. Over to Levi. Levi, back to Ibanez. Oh, okay. It was getting a little scary. Back to Conde. We're really resetting this big time. He's going to get all the way up. There's only more free. Oh, it was going to be offsides anyway. I thought it was, but we hadn't heard the whistle yet, so I was hoping. All right, come on, guys. Oh, come on. Okay. 
We're looking good. But we haven't scored yet, and obviously that's that's bad. Come on, Kande. Over to Levi. Levi over to Sambo. Sambo up to Luca. Luca. He's gonna keep pushing up here. Gets it across. There's Isak. Ah, oh, man, we forget it in there. We're getting some looks, just not getting the goals. Now there's Conde over to Levi again. Sambo. There's Luca. Oh, I thought he was going to take away from him. Sambo back to Levi. Levi up to Mount. Mount to Luca. Luca, come on, buddy. Over to O'Neill Murphy. Murphy. Vieira. Vieira to Lamptey. Lamptey. Nope. He's too deep. Gonna have to get across. There's Luca. Yes. And that's why you're in there, buddy. That's why you're in there, buddy. Thank you, Luca. That head of his. I hope we have that head insured for like multi-million pounds. The most prized possession in our team is, is Lucas' dome on top of his, his nugget. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Iglesias over to Lamptey. Lamptey, come on, buddy. Let's get us another one. Iglesias, I'm going to be greedy. I know we only needed one to make me feel really good about this away leg, but I want a second one now. Oh, oh, should have been in there. Oh, I thought that was I thought that was a guaranteed goal. When he knocked it down, I thought that was a guaranteed goal. Okay, corner kick coming in. Vieira. Luca. Nope, nope, nope. Sam was going to be up to chase this one down. Vieira is actually not playing well today. I gave him the nod, and he's he's not he's not playing as well as I would like to see normally. Like, in fact, I'm tempted to swab him out right now for Sancho. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Halftime sub here. Just not feeling it right now. I mean, he's pleased, but if he was motivated, I might have left him in. He's just pleased. He's, just, he's like, thanks. Thanks, coach, for saying nice things. All right, Levi throwing the ball in. There's Luca. Back to Isak. Sancho with the ball. Over to Iglesias. Iglesias up to O'Neill Murphy. Back to Matt Lamptey. Come on, buddy. Over to Sancho. Oh, Sancho. I just brought you in, buddy. You've got to score that one. That's like a... That, that's a gimme. That is an absolute... Oh, my goodness. All right, let's get Lamptey out of here off his yellow card. Not feeling super confident right now. We're playing a decent game. We just can't get it to go in the back of the net. We're, we're letting some just absolute gimmies just not go. It's Conde over to Ibanez. Back to Conde. Come on, buddy. Don't be, be careful with that. Levi over to Sambo. Sambo to Levi. I don't like this pressure they're putting on us. Ibanez gets it up to Gutierrez. Up to O'Neill Murphy. Oh, he's got it past the defense. He's getting over in this corner. He's going to be able to get a crossover. He's going to get over to Iglesias. Oh, what a... Was that a save or was that off the bar? That was a save. Okay. No, it was a bar. I mean, sorry, bar. Because it didn't go corner kick. Luca over to Isak. Ugh, it's not quite a good pass. Or if Sambo just didn't have the energy to make the move that he thought he was going to. Levi, though, has got it back. There's Luca. Back to Levi. Come on, Iglesias. Over to Sancho. Sancho. Up to Isak. Isak. Gets to O'Neill Murphy. Come on, buddy. That was a save. That's going to be a corner. Their goalkeeper is playing really well today. Corner kick coming in. There's Sancho with the corner. Gets it across. Luca not able to get that one. Sambo down to Iglesias, though. Iglesias, is he going to be able to do something? He's not. Over to Sancho. Back to Ibanez. There's Iglesias. Come on, buddy. Over to Ibe uh, Ibanez. Iglesias. Sambo. Come on, get it in there. Gets it across. Isak. 20th goal of the season for Isak. Okay. A little bit of cushion there, guys. Feeling a little bit better. Surprise, surprise. Atletico Madrid is a pretty good team. One might say one of the four best teams in all of Europe. <laughs> if, if the Champions Cup 
<laughs> means anything. Sambo's getting pretty tired, but we do not have uh, Livermento to come in here because he's injured. Just gotta hold on here, guys. Just a few, just a little bit longer. Sancho up to Isak. Come on, buddy. Isak's over on this right hand side. He gets over to Mount. Mount just gives it up. Ah, just gives it up. All right, but they give it right back again. So there's Levi. Mount with the ball back to Conde. Back up to Ibanez. There's Sancho with the ball. Gets it over to Gutierrez. Over to Luca. Yes. Thank you, Luca. Essential's definitely having a better game than Vieira was having, so good swap there. Lacey is not having the best game in the world right now. I mean, 6 point eight's not bad, but just... I wish he was playing a little bit better. For some reason, he's just... He's not been playing, like, amazingly well lately. Mount was a great pickup. I mean, he, Mount has been playing really, really well. And Ibanez, for the most part, going to hold down the fort pretty well. Um, okay, we're going to actually wait a little bit longer. We already did two subs, so we'll wait for the third one. Just a little bit longer. I am going to turn on... That's probably a bad move. I'm going to turn on a little bit of time wasting. Levi throwing the ball in. There's Sambo with the ball. Over to Iglesias. Iglesias back to Ibanez. Up to Gutierrez. Come on, buddy. Oh, gets tripped up. Is it going to be a penalty? Should be Luca taking it. I think this will be for his hat trick. I don't know if that was a penalty. I mean, he did get tripped up a little bit. I don't know if it was like a, a blatant penalty. Not oh, Davis. Okay. Come on, Luca. Luca. Oh, yeah. Hat trick. All right. We're going to drop down a bit more positive. We're going to slow things down a bit. Just, just, just take it easy, guys. I've heard. I've heard a rumor. I don't know if it's true or not. But if you go into the second leg with a four-game lead, four-goal lead, you're in a pretty good spot overall. All right, last sub of the game. Let's get Iglesias out of here. Bring Cassie in. Let's turn on full-time wasting just, just to try and finish this game out. Sancho with the corner kick. <laughs> now Luca's just scoring for fun. Luca, don't rub it in their faces, buddy. Come on. Now he's just now he's just being greedy. He's just out there like, hey, look at me. I can score from corners without using my head. I can do it with my feet too. Luca, come on, buddy. We've already got four. Don't, don't. Let's not let's not be let's not be obnoxious here. Do we hope, guys? Is it too early to hope? Man. Four girls from Luca. Just absolutely insane. All right. Uh, we'll be right back, guys. I'll be playing the middle Chelsea game. And then we'll come back for second leg. Who's the other teams in this? Oh, Earth of Berlin and PSG. They haven't played yet. Obviously, I assume it's going to be PSG. In fact, I'd almost be disappointed if we didn't go through PSG to win the whole thing. All right, we'll be right back. All right, we're back for game number two. Uh, a couple interesting things. Uh, well, I guess one main interesting thing. We'll get to that in just a second. But we did beat uh, Chelsea three to two. Uh, we actually went down two to nothing at halftime and came back and beat them three to two after that. So good stuff there. Got a pair of goals from Isak and a goal from Kessie. A little bit of rotation, not a full rotation, but a little bit of rotation in this game. Uh, but today, here is the team that we're bringing. Oh, and the interesting thing I should say real quick is that Eartha Berlin be beat PSG five to nothing on aggregate. So three to nothing in the first game. Two to nothing in the second game. Apparently, we got to take them a little bit more seriously than I was giving them credit for. So we're not playing PSG if we get past this game. We're playing Hertha Berlin, who is currently fourth in the Bundesliga. In theory, we're the better team, but they're playing really well, apparently. So here's the team we're bringing today. Conde and go. Gutierrez comes in on the left-hand side to give uh, um, 
Lamptey a little bit of a rest. Sambo on the right, Ibanez and Levi hold the middle. Stevanovic and Iglesias in the uh, midfield, although I'm playing Iglesias on the central midfielder side. Stevanovic will, Stevanovic will play on the roaming playmaker. Sancho comes back in here with Isak and Luka as usual, but Samson comes in here because both O'Neill Murphy and Gerard. Actually, Gerard is actually not fully fit right now, unfortunately. So a little bit of an injury to him, and O'Neill Murphy is a little bit tired, but we'll bring him in if we need him. I think this is going to be a good enough team to get the job done. Hopefully. We'll find out. Let's get into this. Come on, guys. We, we've set ourselves up for an incredibly good run here. Let's finish the job here. Just a couple more games. Just a couple more games. This is our home fans. No excuse for us to 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 give this one up here. All right, throw in here from Gutierrez. Gets it into Isak. Isak over to Sancho. Sancho back to Gutierrez. Push it up. There's Samson. Samson over to Iglesias. Iglesias to Samson. Samson to Sambo. Yes. Sambo. Good setup. That was a really good run. Up. Good few passes there. Good setup there, guys. All right, come on. Made it even harder for him. Made it even harder. Oh, such good passing. Look at that. So beautiful. And Sambo, really, the kicker there was that Sambo did not... He didn't flub it. Like, they gave him the perfect opportunity to get a perfect goal. And he made it count. And that, that's a big deal as well. Sambo with the ball here. Back to Gutierrez. Turns around. Gets it across. There's Luca. Easy go for Luca. Easy go for Luca. Oh, so good. Man, Luca, why do you have to be so old? Why can't you be a youngster? So I could have you for the next 10 years through all of my games. Like through all four countries. The next four countries, I just bring Luca with me everywhere. That would be amazing. But no, he's too old for that. Here's Isak. Over to Samson. Samson. Uh, bad pass there, buddy. Good, good, good effort. Trying to do some defense there. Oh, we got it back though. Sancho gets it up to Luca. Oh, that's okay. That's all right, guys. We don't need it. We don't need it. Just let's just go, guys. In fact, I don't need any more highlights. I've actually got to go somewhere in a couple minutes, so I'm going to leave the house in real life in a few minutes. Let's not let this game go on too long. Sambo throws it in. Back to Luca. Over to Sancho. Sancho. There's Gutierrez down to Isak. Oh, that's okay. That's all right. I mean, let's not get too, too crazy here. Not too, too confident. But good stuff overall. Just, just coast it in here, guys. Just settle in. No craziness, no injuries, no nothing. Ibanez having a pretty tough game right now. Stevanovic not having a great game. All right, there's halftime. They're hanging in there. They're just not scoring. That has to... I've been there, guys. I've been there, Atletico Madrid. I've been there. Stevanovic playing a really bad game. 6.3? Oof. All right, we're going to bring Stevanovic out. Because, obviously, he's not doing good. Um, We will bring... We'll bring Cassie in here. Probably the least likely to play in the next set of games. All right, next sub. Um... Mm, let's bring Isak out. We'll get uh, O'Neill Murphy a chance to get some game time. Is this a real highlight? There's just a... Because I just did swappy do highlight. <laughs> Glacies over in the corner to Sambo. Sambo to Glacies. To Glacies across. There's Isak. Man, it was a real highlight. Good effort, guys. All right. A little bit of time wasting. I was going to drop down a positive. Just... Settle in here, guys. Don't nothing crazy. Last sub. Uh, we'll get Gutierrez out. Bring Lamptey in. And let's finish this up, guys. No more highlights. No more we'll full-time wasting. No more highlights. Lamptey throwing the ball in. There's O'Neill Murphy. Cross. There's Luca. Not quite. Trying to get his hat trick. Not quite there. 
Oh, I'm sorry, that no, wasn't his hat trick. Sambo got the first go. All right, last probably opportunity here for them to pick up anything to save some face. Suchik, Marie Louise, both of those guys played for us, didn't they? Standing ovation from the fans right here. Although I'm not going to stand because that put me out of camera. <laughs> Pretend I'm standing. Oh, goodness, guys. We've made it to the finals, guys. We've made it to this final. The whole point of the season. The whole point of the season. And we got Hertha Berlin. We get some money, too. Which feels really good. So is it just one game or is it two? It is just one game. Okay. All right. That's fine. It'll be a, it'll be a short game. Honestly, this episode only took 20 minutes. I'm going to give you a bonus. We're going to show the final game in this episode. We'll be right back for game number three of against Hertha Berlin. All right. Today is the day. Today we play Hertha Berlin in the Champions Cup final in uh, I think Budapest. Um, as you can see, we've uh, we won all three of our games leading up to this, which is good. Coming into this game with with proper form is always a good thing. Uh, we beat Tottenham two to one with a goal from Gerard and a goal from Mount. And Tottenham's actually the team that went on to win the FA Cup. Had we not played rotation against Aston Villa, I think we could have won the FA Cup, which is a little disappointing. Um, in retrospect, I do regret that, but it is what it is. If we get the Champions Cup, I can't complain too much else about the way the season went. Uh, we then went up against Watford and beat them three, or sorry, four to zero with a hat trick from Gerard and a goal from O'Neill Murphy. Both of our wonder kids picking up goals, and then we beat Wolves four to one with a goal from Isak, a goal from Gerard, a goal from Sancho, and a goal from Mason Mount. Um, yeah, we ended up the season second place as expected. 91 points, which is actually, I think, five points less than we did last season. Let's check here. Oh, no, last season we had 97 points. So we're six points less than the last season. So, eh, 91 points actually would not have been a good good enough for... It would have been fourth place last season because Arsenal actually did quite a bit better. But 91 points, still pretty good. Uh, Man United just ran away with this one big time. But we qualify for the Champions League again next season. So the team's going to be happy with that, I'm sure. And uh, overall, not, not bad. Um... Oh, uh, who else? What was I gonna say? Uh, oh yeah, oh no, Murphy. He got Young Player of the of the Year, um, so that's a good honor for him. And overall, just like I said, just really, really positive play from everybody. Really looking forward to today's game and see what happens. Here's the team we're bringing today. Um, Conde comes in to goal. Lanty on the left. We're gonna bring Livermento on the right. He's playing a bit better right this second than Sambo. Uh, plus, Sambo wasn't really happy with my. He's the only person who was not happy with my team talk coming into this game, which is a little weird. Um, but everybody else was pretty was was mostly happy with it. Uh, I say he was mostly happy. They were slightly improved um, overall morale. He was the only one that was negative. So between that and the fact that he he uh, Livermento is actually just playing better right now, we're going to play bring Livermento in. Iglesias and Mount hold up the midfield. Sancho gets the nod for Shadow Striker. Vieira uh, is actually not playing super great over the last five games. Not quite a seven point oh. And then we've got. Uh, Gerard, Isak, and Luca. Obviously, Isak and Luca stay their main places. And then Gerard comes in over O'Neill Murphy. O'Neill Murphy's great. We might bring him in as an impact sub, but Gerard's just playing just that little bit better right at this second as well. Uh, any reason to move these things around? No, nah, I think Gerard actually better over there, and Isak can play at false nine. All right, let's get into this, guys. This would be such a big deal if we can knock this off the list. Oh my goodness, this would make. I cannot. I can't even believe we're in the conversation. Newcastle, I didn't think Newcastle United could do this. I'll be honest. I knew they could eventually. And I've talked about that before. Eventually, we could have got Newcastle United there. I didn't think we were going to get there this fast. I'm I'm impressed. I'm pleasantly surprised. And I'm super happy about it. But we got one more game to take care of here. One more game to take care of. Tiny bit of motivation there. Not a lot. Five game win streak for us coming into this game. A little bit of a uh, kind of a inconsistency there for Hertha Berlin. Hope that plays into our advantage. 
Uh, Arthur Berlin is actually where we got uh, Gerard from, right? I think so. Um, so good to see him coming back here. 77 degrees. That's actually a pretty nice day out. 77 degrees Fahrenheit. Come on, guys. Arthur Berlin is a really strong team. They have to be to get this far. They have got through PSG. Of course they're strong. All right, there's a uh, goal kick from Hertha Berlin. They get the highlight here, unfortunately. The first highlight goes to them. Come on, guys. Play some defense. Oh, there we go. Livermento is able to chase that one down. Gets it back to Conde. Conde gets it over to Ibanez. Ibanez back to Conde. Conde gets it up to... There's Lamptey. Come on, Lamptey. Push it, push it, push it. Gets it over to Sancho. Sancho. Uh, Gerard is offsides. Man. Come on, guys. No, he's also. I don't even have to look that hard. Man. Come on, guys. Play better than that. He just wasn't paying attention at all. I mean, good finish. I'm glad he, maybe, you know, he finished the, the goal there. That's, that's, that's always good to see, but just wasn't paying attention. Corner kick coming in for Hertha Berlin. Come on. And we go down one nothing. First time we've been down like in a game like this in a very long time. Man, come on, guys. I mean, we're playing well. We just can't get a score. I and mean, we're getting shots like crazy. Five on target. Nothing going in the back of the net. Their goalkeeper's playing better than ours. Tiny bit of motivation there. Come on, guys. What is going on? This is not my team. Corner kick coming in from Sancho. Come on, Luca. Get one back. Yes. I don't like this. It's nervous, nerve wracking. One to one. It's too close. All right, come on, guys. But hey, the fans deserve a good game. This is like a five nothing blowout, one way or the other. Nobody likes that. I mean, it's fun, sort of, but not... Close games are always fun, right? Keep you on the edge of your seat. All right. Who are we swapping out? If anybody. He might Iglesias, but he's motivated. Maybe Gerard. Gerard's just playing okay. I'm going to give O'Neill Murphy the chance. See if he can do anything better. I just... I don't know. Gerard... Nothing. I want somebody to step up and, and do something here. Here's a throw in from Levi into Livermento. Livermento gets it over to Luca. Luca turns around, gets it back to Levi. Levi gets tripped up big time. Is this gonna be a red card? Okay, guys, this is our game to lose. We need to win this now with the with the advantage here. There's no excuse to lose this here. Come on, guys. Put some pressure on him. Put some pressure on him. Get on him. But don't don't let him have don't let him have the easy one here, guys. Stop it. Come on. Oh, come on. Chase that down. Chase that down. So close. We got a little deflection. We're just gonna get on it. Back to the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper kicks it up. Levi's able to get over to Ibanez. Ibanez over to Iglesias. Iglesias to Sancho. Sancho up to Lamptey. Lamptey to Isak. Isak gets it up to O'Neill Murphy. Oh, he's too deep. He's not gonna be able to get the strike himself, but he gets it over to Luca. Uh, offsides, really? I don't know about that one. The first one I knew for sure was this one. Okay, I was going to say, this one didn't look offsides to me. 57th goal of the season for Luca. Oh, 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 oh. Luca, you're so good. I love you, man. Mm -hmm. Come on, guys. Keep it up. Keep it up. I mean, we're starting to come alive here, but we've only got the one goal lead, so... Can't start celebrating yet. I think just from a fitness standpoint, just to keep guys fit and ready, I think we do go to Swappy Glaciers. I'm glad he's playing well. Uh, we're going to get Vieira to nod. I, 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 Vieira, we know Vieira's good. He's not played, played well over the last five games, but we know he's good, and we're going to give him the chance. He's our veteran. We know he can do this. Luca chases that one down. 
uh, gets deflected, but there's Livermento back to Luca. Luca gets over in the corner. He gets it across. There's O'Neill Murphy. Nothing going there. That's okay. It's all right. I don't think I want to slow like any do time waste or anything like that right now. We've got to play this to the end, I think. Sancho with the ball. Back to Livermento. Livermento gets it across to Sancho. Sancho gets it up to Lamptey. Lamptey goes for goal. Only his second goal, but it's a big one. Big goal for Lamptey. Good stuff. All right, now we got the cushion we need. Now I'm okay with turning on a little bit of time wasting. Two gold cushion, I'm okay with that. Only one gold cushion, I'd rather just keep the boys focused and aggressive. Although with the advantage, you know. All right, last sub if we're going to do one. Yeah, we're going to do one. Lamptey's tired. It's playing well, but let's let's get some fresh legs in here. Bring Gutierrez in here. He's played well enough this year to deserve a nod in this final game. All right, just going to turn on full-time racing just for these last couple minutes, guys. Just hold on for a couple more minutes. We've got this. Oh, no, don't get him one back. Don't let him get one back here. Come on. Wow. Wow. Can we hold on for a couple more minutes here? Five minutes of extra time. It's a lifetime. Oh, I thought we were going to get it. Last whistle. Don't let him get a draw here. Come on. Keep it up. Sancho over Luke. Oh. Whistle, 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 whistle. Oh, wow, guys. Newcastle United. Oh, I love this team. I love this team so much. Oh, my God. And I don't... It, is the team this year better than the team last year that won the Premier League and the FA Cup and the Carabao Cup? I don't... I, I think so. Because I think the only reason we lost the... You know, some of the games we lost is because I was just rotating people and being, being very kind of nonchalant about the league play. I mean, it's hard to say. We had a great team last year. We had a great team this year. Both of them accomplished what they were set out to accomplish, quite frankly. Wow. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness, guys. Luca pair of goals. Only Murphy did pick up a goal. Oh, I'm sorry, did he? Yeah, yeah. No, what's that symbol mean? Oh, it's assist. Assist. He picked some assist. I was gonna say it was like he didn't get a goal. He got an assist. Luca picked up the two goals. And then who was the other goal? Oh yeah, Lempty. Oh, we're actually pretty dominant in that game. Even though it was close it was way closer than it should have been. Way closer than it should have been. But statistically, we were incredibly dominant in that game. Wow. We are a Champions Cup winning manager. And we complete another treble. We got a treble last year. We got a treble this year. Although this treble doesn't really count that much. Do we really count the English Community Shield as <laughs> hoorah, yay us? I mean, the Carabao Cup's one of the trebles in both both years. Could have been the FA Cup. Should have been the FA Cup. I really should have. Um, but that's okay. We weren't focused on that. That wasn't important. Got some money. Got a bunch of medals for everybody. Good stuff all around. Apparently the fans are loving me right now. That's always good to see. Too bad uh, I am leaving now. 100%. No reason whatsoever to stay at Newcastle. We will leave the team if we're still at Newcastle because there is there is no reason to be here. We've accomplished everything we possibly can at Newcastle. Everything we possibly can. Now we're getting a good chunk of money thrown around. A big chunk of money going back out to the players there. Uh, we also Did I mention we got the league rec or the record number of goals for Champions League? Uh, Manchester United had the previous one, which was, I think, 38 goals. We got 42 before this game. So I guess we got up to 45 goals, I think, overall, which is a record 
for most number of goals in a Champions League run. Pretty cool. Bunch of bonuses paid out. Calvin Phillips, we paid too much. I, oh well. I mean, we didn't use him that much. We used him a little bit rotationally, but hardly at all, to be fair. Paid him $2 million for him. whoop to do I, I'm okay with that. At the end of the day, our finances are not great. We're still classified as rich, and they've got some players they could sell on if they, if they want to kind of tone back a little bit. And they're in the Champions League again next year. So we set them up in a pretty decent spot overall. All right, there's one more thing to do. I'll be right back. All right, here we go. Uh, again, I need some music for this, but um, without, I guess, any fanfare. Dump, ba -dump, bump, bump. 2031, Champions League checked off with Newcastle United. Is it going to be that the Europa League is going to be the harder one to get? Uh, I forgot that technically Europa League is still out there, so technically we do still have something that we could win with Newcastle United, but we would have to try really hard to like fail down to that level at this point, I think. Um, so I don't know. We'll see where the Yoba really comes into this. We'll have to we'll have to figure that one out. Hopefully that's not the elusive one that we have to chase down at some point in the future. But we shall see. But there we go, guys. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited. I think this video deserves a like. Maybe. Hint, hint. Wink, wink. Um, and a subscribe. And a channel membership. And comments. And all the fun things. <laughs> because that will help support the channel. And let me know that you are enjoying this content as much as I'm enjoying making it. Who should we go to next, guys? France? Germany? Italy? Or Spain? They're all open. We've got a lot of work still to do, guys. We've got, I mean, this is the 2030-2031 season, so we've been doing this for, what is this? This is the ninth season overall? Yeah, right? This is the ninth season? Um, wait. <laughs> Sorry, I got to do the math in my head. Um, no, this is, the, this is the 10th season. This is the 10th season overall, so we got 15 seasons left to get four leagues, four cups, and three world, you know, kind of European slash worldwide championships. It's not going to be easy. We got our work cut out for us, but knocking all this out with Newcastle United, huge, huge lift. Um, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below about our run so far and who you think I should go to. And obviously by then, how will you will know because you'll know tomorrow or whatever the next episode is. But I do appreciate you guys watching. Uh, may God bless you. And I really hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.